Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Yoshi's Story. Today we're doing Poochie and Nippion, page 3. This one's not my favorite level, but it's not as bad as I remember it, really. Yep. And we got Miss Warp 1 right there at the beginning to start off. And I've been having performance problems with this level too, so it's gonna look weird when pages turn. Anyway. I got the first melon right down there. These things you just stand on them, they're seesaws. They work pretty much like you would expect. Uh, first heart. Really horrible. I don't know how we were supposed to figure that out. I, I actually had to look that up. I couldn't find it. Searching the entire freaking level. You, you can't even hear it when you're standing there. It, it's too high up, I guess. Anyway, there's a block thing. There's going to be four flying shy guys. Hit them all with one egg to get a melon. So, hit them all with one egg and get a melon. And here's the mini game already. Uh, be careful not to go too far forward because there's shy guys with snowball throwing over there. And if they see you, then they'll start trying to throw a snowball at you. But if they do, then you'll, they'll probably still miss. They're not very accurate. And the trick to this one is, well, shy guys with snowballs, but if you're moving forward all the time, they shouldn't be a problem. But then there's the pits. Yeah. Which aren't that bad, really, actually. Just jump over them instead of worrying about the platforms. And you're probably gonna be good. There's two of those pits, and hey. Seven melons! Delicious. And let her eye. Refill our egg. Miss Warp 2. And these are actually uh, coin hints from the uh, super happy fruits. So come up here and you can get another super happy fruit. Just keep it going. Move right along. Here we have a little thing of blocks. Hit the center one and there's a. Whoops, missed. And there's a heart there. Yeah. There's a melon there. That one's a little hard to get because you're on a big seesaw and you gotta send it down a ways. But I'm, there were some coins here, but I missed them. And ten melons, and we're done with the first section. And Miss Warp three, and we're on to a slightly more annoying section. Melon there. This area is like a little mini maze thing. You'll see what I mean in a second. But first. Get rid of these freaking snowball shy guys. Go away. And for like pretty much the rest of the level, whenever you see one of these, you wanna one of the flowers, you wanna stomp on it and get a melon. And then see we get two pads. It should be completely obvious which way we're supposed to go, but if you go up here instead of the way Poochie shows, and then up again on the next level screen, uh, you'll get to a screen where there's a uh, red pipe and poochie in a little area near the beginning where you can't reach so then that's a clue that in that screen you go to the red pipe go down and you'll find the white uh, Yoshi egg there if you don't already have white Yoshi but I'm not gonna go that way because it's out of the it's out of the right way you don't want to go that way unless you're looking for the Yoshi there's no melons that way anyway. here we have goonies with bombs evil and of course there's a heart so melon Pretty much the only sniffing you need to do is, uh, well, uh, well, all the stomping melons are on the hearts, or the flowers, sorry. So you don't really need to sniff at all, fortunately. Ah, bombs. Okay, and here's two blocks. You can probably guess what we do with those by now. We dodge bombs, that's what we do. Now it is my turn to throw bombs! Ha ha ha! But that block right there is again useless, it doesn't do anything. And Falapucci. Maybe like it's if you in case you stomp one of them on accident and then oh hey there's another one. Okay, push these two that are still left together and you'll get a melon. Anyway. Uh slightly annoying area. There's a couple pink blues up there. They don't do anything. Yeah. Just see if you aim right there so you don't actually hit it and then make it so they'll they'll blow up instead of hitting the thing then you can take them all out and you want to leave the bottom ones obviously because those are platforms but 
you want to still take out some of them because there's melons in the middle of there. Ugh, this is annoying. Uh, this is very annoying in multiple ways. Okay, let's try this. Uh, oops, nope. Oh well. Get that one out of the way. And aim right here. Don't go too low. Okay. This one is going to be a pain. If you get the shy guy in accident, then you're screwed. Ugh. Just wait for it. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, those things are such a pain. Okay, there's nothing up here. I don't know why I went over there. And we have another. Oops, flower. Ooh, there. Melon, and we go this way. <laughs> Screen three. More goonies with bombs. Yeah. And we will never stop. Well, you'll see what I'm talking. Anyway, hey, look at that. There's old coin trail up there. I wonder what that means. That means go up and then lick. Oh. -ho. And it means throw eggs at Goonies. Sheesh. They're freaking everywhere. Stab it. Go away. Oh, dang it. Did more. Die! Oh, he'd already dropped his bombs, so it's pointless. Anyway, whoa, whoa. And our heart fruit. Delicious. Infinite eggs. And the last one. Unsurprisingly, I, I keep missing that last one every single time, and only that one. <laughs> I don't know. Ah, bombs. Uh, I don't know why. Anyway, random goalpost. I don't get it, but you push the block to here and you get a melon. I don't get why there's a goalpost there. I really don't. Oh, I'm already full. And a melon, of course. Three left. We're going to go down here. There's Poochie. And on to the last area. This one, again, has Goonies, but not all of them have bombs this time. And in case you didn't know, you can stand on them. So we want to get on one of these. There's a flower down there. We'll get that later. Because we want to go this way first. Some of them do still have bombs, though. So you, eh, you don't get hurt or anything if you fall, so don't worry about that. But to up here... Whoa, bombs. Keep going... Or the last heart. Yeah. And a bunch of coin arrows there in case you didn't think to go up on your own. It'll tell you, hey, go up! And our last flower. These guys will go away. And that's all the melons! But by now you're not going to be tricked into thinking there's no boss, so... Oh my. Cloud Gin. My fiery breath is very hot. These spiked balls are certainly not. I I don't get it either. It's a forced rhyme, I guess. Anyway. This guy, what you have to do is uh, basically just hit him in the head with eggs. There's two butter bees up. See, yeah, he'll rub spiked balls. The, yeah. I mean, the hardest part about this one, in my opinion, is actually catching the eggs. Since ah, it, it, his flame isn't really that much of a threat. Whoa, 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 whoa! <laughs> but it's like there's no actual solid ground, so the eggs just go flying. Anyway, hey, come back here. Ah, oh. He's the easiest to hit when he's coming. Whoops. I have to actually. Whoops. I didn't get a hit on my test run, but whatever. You have to actually hit him with. What the heck? I'm not doing very good. Eh. 
There we go. Have to actually hit him with the egg, not the explosion. Yep. And he has invincibility frames. Whoa, that was close. Oh, there's three butteries. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna get down here. There we go. Delicious. Hey, he's not that hard. I made him look harder than he is, I'd say. <laughs> and that's it! For Poochie and Nippy. Your score. <laughs> not bad at all. And move on to our story sequence. And that's it for Poochie and Nippy. Uh, next time we get to do Piranha Grove. So not looking forward to that one. Though I imagine it can't be as bad as Jungle Puddle. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching everybody.